Aloha and welcome to Beach Walks with Rocks. You can find us at beachwalks.tv. All right, Lexi, let's go for a walk. Hi, everybody. You know, I had something happen last weekend that I found really stressful. And this little part of my brain was saying, just go with the flow, just go with the flow. And I really resented the sound of those words, even though normally, of course, I would say, sure, that makes sense. And, you know, I got to thinking that there is, sometimes that phrase, that saying, is interpreted as being very passive. And I was not feeling passive at all. I was feeling very energized, animated, a little uh, angry. And, and so it didn't work for me to just say, oh, just go with the flow, all new agey. And I started realizing that what that really can mean is to, to actually navigate. You know, that if we think of life as this giant river, not as a little river that I'm getting bounced around in, but as this giant river that on the one hand, yeah, there are a lot of things I can't do anything about, but I can still navigate my way through it and I can be more like a uh, river rafter who doesn't just sit in the river and let the river bounce him or her all around, but in fact has an oar, has a boat, um, and is looking ahead to see what's coming around the next corner, you know, what rocks might be in the way that are a hindrance, what rocks might be in the way that are helpful. And it's kind of like that, you know, that show we did a while back on what's the opportunity. And, you know, I just, I really appreciated having that little thought process for myself and it helped me reclaim my energy and not feel so, you know, under, under the thumb of the universe, so to speak. So the Hawaiian word, there's two words for today that I looked up on the way here this morning and one is holo, which is to flow as in water, which I just love that energy of flow. I love it. I love it. I love it. And when it isn't flowing in the direction that I want, then I can practice ho'okele, which is the art of navigation, to navigate. And being able to remember that, yes, in the big picture, I may not have control over a lot of things. In the moment, I do have the ability to navigate and choose, if nothing else, how I want to feel about a situation, even if I can't change the external uh, realities of the situation and that in and of itself uh, gives me comfort. So we're running into the fisherman's lines here so I'm going to say aloha and malamapono.